Hey guys, welcome back to the vlog. Today we have so much going on. So tomorrow morning we're flying to London. We're gonna be in London for 24 hours. But today I have some errands to run. So I want to get ready. I want to show you some new clothing pieces and basically take you with me today. So let's go. Okay, I'm sitting down with the coffee. I want to show you a few pieces that I just got delivered from El Copini. These are more like spring stuff that I wanted to get and some of the pieces I definitely plan to take them to London tomorrow. I want to start with the sweaters uh, that I definitely needed to order a few because I keep using the same black and white one from Totem and having a few more for the rotation when they go to dry cleaning is always nice. So I'm going to show them to you and possibly change into one because it's a little bit chilly still in the mornings. I mean, the weather started to get really nice here in Barcelona but still you need to have you know the sweater so I'm gonna film mud shots of every single piece because right now I am of course in my pajamas but in case you're interested El Copini has such an amazing quality I love their pieces I love their coats and I'm really happy to see that they are implementing new stuff for spring and summer a little bit I think I saw that they're gonna release a few dresses here and there so I'm excited about that after this one we're gonna pack but I'm gonna show you the first sweater so this is the April sweater in black black is a staple it's cashmere and I really like the v-cut that it has but this one is super lightweight I didn't want to have anything like too chunky and too hot so I think this is sort of perfect for now I got the exact same one in white that I think I'm gonna put it on right now because this one I want to take it to London with one of the coats so I'm gonna change really fast so this is the white one I think it's probably my favorite I love 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 white sweaters and this is actually super lightweight so I think I'm gonna use it a lot this and the black if they had the exact same style in gray in blue in pinks I would probably get it again I really like the way that the neck looks I have another sweater from El Copini that is also white but it's quite different from this one I'm gonna show you some videos of it in case you're interested and I'm gonna link it in the description box down below if they still have it I think right now what I definitely need instead of the chunky sweaters that I invested on a lot during the winter is something a little bit more lightweight that maybe you don't want to have it on all day so you can just put it over your shoulders like something really comfortable to carry around too and there are some sweaters that are small enough that you can fold them and fit them into your bag and this is the last sweater this is gray and I'm kind of having a thing for gray this has a turtleneck I absolutely love the color I think this is gonna be such a good transitional piece and it's a little bit more formal so I'm really excited about using this one too so let me fold it I got two other pieces and one is like kind of too edgy for me I would love to know what you think I do think like it's so cool so I'm excited to see how it looks on um, I'm gonna grab it and it's a suede micro jacket I know I know just tell me what you think so this is like a brownish, grayish type of color. I really like the look of it. It's not gonna show here, so I'm gonna definitely have to put barrel of it, but this is such a cool piece and it has shoulder pads so it definitely makes you look a little bit more like sleek this is not coming because I feel like London is gonna be a little bit more chill than this so yeah definitely let me know what you think but you're gonna see how it looks when I show you the mod shots but I was really excited to try this piece and you know venture a little bit outside my shirt and sweater style that I just cannot seem to try anything new so now this is way more my style and probably my favorite piece this is going to debunk the Eloise puffer jacket that I'm gonna show it to you like it's this puffer that it looks like even sort of like Chanel. It's from El Copini, but it's so good and it's so warm. I took it to the snow and it was so hot. So it was an amazing piece to have for that. But this is the Coco jacket, so it's white. Um, I'm gonna try to put it on for you right now. Like it's so soft. This I'm definitely taking to London, like for sure. I'm gonna pack it right now. So since we're only gonna go 24 hours, I'm just gonna take this coat, this sweater, and um, like two shirts underneath, two pants, and like underwear and that stuff. But I don't want to carry much. Like it's only 24 hours, so there's no 
no purpose in packing more than two outfits the one that i'm gonna go with and the one for the next day so if you're interested in the pieces i'm gonna link them in the description box down below and i love working with el cupini i will have a link for my furless section they have coats long coats short coats cashmere sweaters and if they give me a discount code i'm gonna give it to you right now thank you so much el cupini for working with me now i want to go pack i'm gonna explain a little bit why i'm going to london because i know that it's gonna be very random i just came back from portugal like three four days ago and now i'm packing for london and next week we have polo's friends staying with us for a few days so i am tired but i feel fulfilled i i don't know if that's the word but definitely tired i am going to london with whatnot and if you guys don't remember i work with whatnot like july of last year and it's basically an app where you do live streams and during the live streams there's sellers like season to consign for example and fashionica and they just launched in the uk it's a lot of fun because you get to be it so they invited me to go do a live stream once a month for the next three months so i'm basically gonna fly to london do a live stream and fly back i get to meet a lot of people i love london i haven't been in london in like five or six years i think the last time that i was in london was 2017 i don't know how much we're gonna be able to actually do i'm gonna try to vlog as much as i can in london but 24 hours and going with a brand it's going to be very complicated so i'm gonna try to take you with me probably is coming this time so i'm gonna be able to disconnect my brain basically i am the one who plans the trip beforehand and i'm the one who is like oh let's go here let's go there but when we're traveling i just follow him like his duck mom and i'm a duckling just following him around the airport he gets into this like dad mode and he makes sure that everyone has the passport that we get there in time i'm so glad that he's coming i'm gonna have such a good time i'm really excited i'm gonna go also in may and i'm gonna go also in june so if i don't get to do like a proper vlog this time i promise that in may it's probably gonna happen i am definitely concerned about how much i'm realistically going to be able to do if i'm gonna be like doing more stuff but i want to take you with me we're gonna leave masha with the doggy nanny it's just one night um so we're gonna drop her off tomorrow morning and right now i'm gonna pack like what we need to take today's festive so it's a little bit dead but let's see what we can do around barcelona pack and tomorrow go to london so yeah let's go I changed so we're gonna go out to have lunch but first I want to pack so I'm gonna choose one bag two outfits and leave everything inside because I know that if I don't do it tonight I'm gonna be going insane so let's just read right now so this is a selected bag I think it's casual and formal enough to pull everything together and I'm just gonna take this and like the carry-on remover that we're gonna have to check in because we didn't put carry-on luggage so this is the only thing that I'm gonna take with me on the plane and I think what is just gonna take a backpack or something like that but for the clothes this one for sure white sweater and I'm gonna take the black totem too. Now I'm just gonna pick two pairs of pants and go for the remover, pack everything and we're gonna go out for lunch. Outfit of the day, the shirt is from Massimo Dutti, shorts are from Oisha and the bag of the day, the caramel small classic flow. Okay, we're back home. We ended up going to Soho for lunch. But I just left for a few things. Um, I need to work. I want the luggage fully closed. I'm gonna leave it like literally at the door. So tomorrow morning when we wake up, we can just like and leave. So that's the plan right now. I think that for dinner plans, we're just gonna like get a bottle of wine, something very simple, maybe watch a movie to relax. I have to edit a little bit too. Just, I don't wanna go with anything like pending. I just want to be mentally there like 100%. So I need to make Masha's backpack too because when we leave her at the nanny, it's like toys, her food. I just want to make sure that I don't forget anything. Okay, so luggage in bag, check. We're gonna put it away. With packing done, I just want to make sure that the video that is getting posted on Friday, it's like completely done. I'm going to get to work a little Bit, take her out for a walk and see you tonight at dinner. Hola. 
What are we doing? Just a table of ham and cheese. Guys, we're at the airport again. Basically, I just want to vlog what do we do, 24 hours in London type of vlog. Right now, I'm not super sure about the plans, but I'm so excited to have like really good food, walk around London as much as we can. Tomorrow, we're gonna be back to Barcelona, so yeah, this is gonna be a hectic vlog. Are you excited about London? Yes. I'm a bit worried that we're gonna get tired, like because it's only 24 hours. Yeah, it's like a influencer trip for you. <laughs> okay, I want to go and try a pub like a not an irish pub but maybe a british pub Two hours, so we're gonna take the train that should take 20 minutes or so. The train only takes 20 minutes, so 30 minutes. 30 minutes, here we are. Yeah, but uh, 30 minutes and the Uber was like two hours. So we arrived, we're waiting for the Uber, we're gonna go to the hotel and, and hopefully find... a restaurant. Okay, so we are at the hotel and we're gonna go grab a bite because I'm starving. The hotel is called the Mary Le Bon and we're gonna go look around the area to find something to eat. And uh, after that, we have the live stream, but I'm gonna show you the outfit of the day. So this is what I brought to the airport. This is a new coat that I got from El Copini. It's called the Coco Coat with a cashmere sweater. Pants are from the Frankie shop and my Chanel sneakers. And the bag for the trip, Black Birkin 25. Ready to go eat? Yes, I'm hungry. <laughs> Let's go. The burger. The burger? The Ivy burger? And a beer. Beer? <laughs>
we came back from lunch, we were officially in the hotel, checked in in London. Uh, when I got to the hotel, they gave me this. So I want to make like, like a little unboxing for you. I haven't really done like a Louis Vuitton unboxing in such a long time, so let's open it up. So it's an SLG. And it's the agenda in the PM size, Damien Rassur, and I love the white interior. Like, I use my GM agenda so much that I am so sure that I'm gonna use this one a lot, especially this year. I can use it like my wedding planning, I don't know, junk journaling type of thing. I cannot wait to get home and order some inserts for this one. I want to be creative because I want to use it just as much as I use the GM one, but um, yeah, I'm really grateful. Like, this is so nice. They also gave me one for the live stream that we're gonna give away. Again, when you see this, the live already happened but uh, maybe for the next month they're gonna do one too this video is not like in partnership with them this is just like my vlog of the trip i was really excited when i found out that we were coming to london i definitely need some recommendations for next time like for food and what to do especially if we start coming more often and i'm so over the moon that they let me come with polo this time i'm so calm and so happy and he's helping out a lot oh and i wanted to do a what's in my bag travel edition version because i tried to to do it at the airport but there was like too much noise and nowhere to put it so the wallet that i decided to bring is my constant slim it's lately the only wallet that i use and i use it as a bag and as a wallet too it can be crossbody chanel o-case and here inside i have peels like aspirins i have hair ties jewelry pieces and like a catch-all thing hotel room my apple charger I also have my Dior lip glow. I forgot to bring my Laneige. Is it Laneige? I packed last night really, really late. AirPods, and that's it. So this will be something that I'm gonna start to take into my bags, especially the ones that fit it. And tonight we're gonna have dinner at Nobu. Good sushi, I'm really excited about good sushi. And I think we can go walking and the area is like really nice and the streets have like lights and everything. Like they have these little flags of England on the streets and it can be nice. Walk there. So I'm gonna get ready for the live stream, just like um do my hair a little bit and makeup because I woke up very early today and I got ready really quick before going to the airport. So yeah, I'll see you after the live. I'm done with the live, we're going to have dinner. So I think I'm gonna go to bed early today. Let's see what we did tomorrow. The live stream lasted for two hours. So we, it was like from 6 p.m. to 8 p.m. So by eight, it was already like dinner time. So we rushed to Nabu. Amazing. It was honestly really, really good. And we took the taxi back to the hotel and I was actually thinking about going to a pub and have like a drink or something. And I fell asleep on the cab. So we're here. I took a shower. I'm dead. I'm gonna go to bed. I don't even know if this is gonna be like a proper vlog like i think it was too much for such a short amount of times so let's see good night